I was a mother, a wife, owned uh, three cats, a dog. The kids had the homework, we had jobs, we had everything, but Uncle Sam says, I want you. So I went off to Iraq. So Saddam Hussein had already been captured. He was finally going to go before a judge on his crimes against humanity. It was in a small courtroom, so I took in there Christina Amapour, Peter Jennings, al Arakia, al Arabiya, Al Jazeera. So I'm standing outside, and this part of the story was never reported because all the reporters were inside. And he started yelling at the judge, he started threatening the judge, the judge's family, everyone in the courtroom, and finally the judge kicked him out. And he came out of the courtroom and he saw me and he checked me out. He looked me up and down like I was just a blonde bimbo, a piece of meat, I don't know. And I looked at him and I thought, I don't think so. So I am using every nonverbal skill I have to look right back at him. So as he's looking at me, I'm looking at him. I remember what General Sanchez said. General Sanchez had said when he had looked in Saddam Hussein's eyes, he saw pure evil. So I'm looking, because I don't know what pure evil looks like. So I'm looking, <laughs> and I'm like, oh, I don't know if I see pure evil. I see a dirty old man. I don't know about pure evil. So there we are, neither one of us is backing off. And finally, he barks out some command, and the guards laugh. And then they take him away. And I turn to another guard, and I'm like, well, what do he say? Kill her. He used to kill people for staring at him. And today, I believe, we know where he is. And I am very glad to be here with you all tonight.